Uh, hi guys. Uh, so today I'm doing a video that has nothing to do with Monster High at all. Um, and it's a tutorial on how to draw a very, very cute duckling. Now, recently I've started drawing because it's fun. <laughs> and with this pattern for the duckling that I just kind of came up with, I guess. I don't know. Um, I have also done this trick again. It's very bad. <laughs> it's the worst one I've done. The penguin. Red bird for my little sister. Her favorite color is red and yeah. And the owl. The owl is my favorite. It's the only one that's mine besides the dragon, I guess. I don't know. So I'm just going to put these back up here. So the stuff I use is I have two pencils, two mechanical pencils. One is 0 0.7 millimeters and the other is 0 0.5. Um, and then I have my erasers. I have a big one for like the lines that are kind of like in the body here. There. And then I have my little one. It's a mushroom. <laughs> for for um, like the little lines, details that I can't really get with this one. So yeah, the mushroom one is from this thing. It's a mushroom filled with tiny mushrooms. My friend got it for me, and I think it's really cute. So, yeah. And then I'm using a 48-pack of Crayola Crayons. That's backwards, I think. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I might, I'm going to have to watch the video after this. So, yeah. Pretty beaten up. On the top here, it's where I keep all my fragments. I, yeah. Oh, I have another small eraser in there. It's a fish. Let me grab it. So, we're going to get started. First of all, you can take one of your pencils, or a pencil, and draw a circle for the head. Draw lightly. And then, sort of an oval shape under it. The head can be as big as you want, as small as you want. Cut. Alright, then you're going to draw the guidelines for the face. Like so. Alright, um, next you're going to draw the outline of the face and body. I don't really like doing the whole steps for that, so I just draw the curved part here, right there, to make it look fat and chubby and cute. Alright, next I'm going to draw the eyes. Now, they're basically just ovals. One can be big, one can be small, one can be small, one can be big. They both can be the same size. It doesn't matter, however you want to do it. So, there are the eyes. I like to make one big and one small, just because I feel like it. <laughs> and then you're going to draw three circles in, the, in both of the eyes, like this, sort of in a triangle. Alright, next, what, what I like to do is the feet. The feet, I think, are the hardest part because you have to get them just right. So mine might turn out might not turn out very well because I'm trying to go fast for you so I'm not just talking to you like that. <laughs> so I'm just gonna quickly draw these. They might not be the best. And then usually I like to No, I don't. See? That right there is the kind of detail I'm talking about that I need my tiny eraser for. So I'm going to erase that, because I don't want that. And redraw my line right there, because I got to erase a little bit. So those are the feet. Not very good, just telling you that. Yours will probably turn out better, because you're going to take your time. Next, we're going to draw, um, up here I want to draw, like, little hair, sort of. Ducks don't have hair, but, like, feathers, maybe. I don't know. But I want to draw that, so I always draw it. So spiky, sort of. Makes it cuter. So that's right there. Okay, next I'm going to draw the wings. The wings are curved like a duck, because <laughs> it is a duck. So that's the wings. 
I'll show you the wings on some other ones. The wings are different on this one. They're the same on the penguin. And they're different on the owl. And obviously on the dragon, because it's a dragon. Alright, so, and then I'm going to draw light lines, two light lines in each of them. Just to show, like, their feathers. And I'll get it real close there for you. Yeah. Alright, next I'm going to draw the beak. The beak is going to be slightly curved. So first of all, I'm going to draw a line right there, like that. And then, like... I don't know, a half oval maybe, that's what it's called, like that. And then under that, I'm going to draw the second half of the beak, which is just, oh, kind of a curved half circle, you can see it right there. And then in the end, I'm going to draw two light dots for its nostrils. Oh, that's for you. There you go. All right. Now, I'm going to stop the video, and I'll come back with part two in a little bit. So, yeah, I'm going to erase all the lines and stuff. I don't know, maybe I could show you that. I don't know, maybe I'll show erasing my last few lines. So, yep, check in, look for that.